right, I'm back. It was real quick. That should be done too, I think, so. Let us take that off the screen and let's see how we can try to reorganize this whole thing. As well as the formations, to be honest. Extra experience packs are not necessary, but they are nice to have just for certain people to be rocketed up. Not necessarily good for damage dealing though. Like I eventually would want Allison to be in a magic focus pack so she can use her her actual magic stat. And I'm predicting that the magic stat might actually just be incredible. But I don't know which one would have a lot of things for us. Don't you have my books of magic skills? Maybe. I don't know yet, Angelo. Maybe. I have to check that. We have Lamp Fog, we have Block Physical uh, Moon Counter, and Vanguard Heal. Not many options, if I do say so myself. Lamp Fog is AoE, right? It might be. Attack him, uh, enemy all, yes. Summons gaseous mana. Depend on DMP, uh, speed, two arrows going to the right, enemy all. How's it going, Slash and Ghoul? Welcome! So, if we wanted to alleviate this and start going more, how would we want to do this? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine units that want to be Vanguard. The other three do not care if they're, or no, we have nine units that want to be Vanguard. Two that do not mind being Vanguard or Rear Guard. And then three that want to be Rear Guard. How can we sort them? And which formation do we want to go for? I'm half debating Pinsir, but I'm not sure. Like something like this, so that way the Vanguards would have a high chance of hitting and, and getting stuff, while the Rear would have dodged and some other stuff. Oh god. Mike accidentally. I don't know if it would work. But even then, we can go for a Donham attack, and that increases... You know, hold on. There's an easy way to see all this. You just have to be in a, in a, in a dungeon. Warp formation? Maybe. No. Ha, you fool. I'll cut down all in my way. All right, so our options are all out attack. Not possible. Not comfortably, at least. Withdraw, that's for the Reaper. Pincer is the Vanguard gains hit and status resistance, while the Rear gains guard rate and a flat heal. A 10% heal on each turn. Advance could also work. The Vanguard gains 20% attack, while the Rear gains 40% avoid. We'd have to, I almost would feel, put our tanks in the rear guard, though. Decoy. Would be Vanguard attack, defense, fortify coven effect is reduced, but target rate up. So whoever's on, the, on that one thing, they get all the hate. Which, ideally, you would put all your, what's it called, tanks in, but the fortify coven thing being 20%. Oh no, the defense up also good. And you, we could put the experience one in there, and that would incentivize it. But we have more vanguards than needed for that. Our current one convoy only benefits the rear guard. They get act speed, uh, action speed up, target down, and they heal 50% each turn. Donham defense is... The rear, which is three of them, gain increased defense. Donham power plus 70%. And the rear heals 10% max HP each turn. Dunham attack is Vanguard up 
attack up and Dunham power up for the Vanguard only. Considering what, considering our mages, our mage singular mage right now, wants to be get that boost but also be in the rear guard. Dumb defense might be what we do. We have to have some mismatch. I don't know. The rear gains bonus defense though. That could almost combat the um, uh, experience packs reduction in defense. Hmm. I'm leaning toward Donham attack. I'll do my best. Bolsa. Here, die, pig. We did it. So I'm leaning toward either Donald attack or Donald defense. All right, so let's see. This is Donald defense. So if you want to fit all of this into Donald attack, the rear guard. We don't really use this one at all, but it does have the, um, uh, not gonna cheer. It's kind of nice. Mm. Put everything here that we're probably gonna end up using and see how we're gonna use it. Let's put everyone. Not carrying our position for the moment, just get everyone on the board. And then we can start sorting out placements. Alright, so. Assuming we wanna stick with Dunham Attack. Attack is the one that gets the bonus to magic. So. Unfortunately, possibly. We're gonna have to be a bit. Put all the tanks in one coven right here so they all will be targeted more and gain the maximum bonus of HP, defense, attack, D uh, DMP, and all that. And avoid, actually, too. The cats are giving all their buffs. Only having half mismatch rather than three mismatch. Yeah. Also, Allison or Flan. And how about Allison with a heal and someone else here? Then we have one more slot that could be anyone, assuming they don't mind being. Actually, wait. I forget. Okay, no. You can be in the Vanguard or the Rear Guard. I forgot. Spears don't care. I nearly forgot about that. So technically, William and Ma Welshwitz are flex units. They can go into anything else to fill up a space and still be fine. Is there, is there a possibility that you do stream, uh, streams on Sundays if you need to wrap up the game fast to leave place for another? I don't at the moment. No. I want to have at least some days off, man. 
Ideally, too. I do the podcast on Sunday just because it's low stress and just just talk with Solo. That's it. Talk about anything that comes to mind. Oh, the guy for the flex units? Yeah. I'm gonna try that. All flex units go to support for the moment. Technically, Flan as well. Flan and Mai. As you guys also can be, what's it called? Van and Rear Guard. The tanks want to be in the. want to be Vanguard. And plus, being in the um, uh, extra experience G Pact, not only lets them level up faster, also means they're going to be targeted far more often because the cats are there to support. And also, what Capricorn said is correct. And Nurso isn't Bell anymore, right? No, he is not. Uh, he is Spear at the moment. Or no, Hammer. Ogre. I think he could go Bell, though, technically, right? Think I missed today so far? Not necessarily, no. Just us going into... Going into a new area and... Trying to figure shit out. Because it's all darkness all the time. Right now we made two characters from YouTube and we're trying to slot them in properly. While updating everyone's uh, packs. There's gonna be only 36 reinforcements. I can't do that because that's the gossip pact. Twitch in its own little way. We don't need the gossip pact anymore. So we could go something like the festival pact if need be. Which is rapid type only, but they get a void. Is there a two pack that I can use? I mean, technically not your roof pack for more HP. And we would get our illusion traps and everything. Or if we need to, the black paper pack. It's just a blank thing. We do have two of them, right? We do, indeed, yes. Their void will be added to the attack. And these ones are 100% of the slot character's hit will be added to the attacker's hits. And their HP 5% or below. It's below 5%. 100% chance of 80% damage. This could be slotted in as one of the um, uh, backline ones, and we just have to make it work out a little bit more. We're like, this could be the festive pack right here. And we can do like... That. So now there, there will be avoided. Their avoid will be added to the attacker avoid, which I don't remember if they had good avoid or not. I don't even. I mean, it's D, but still, it's stuff being added onto attack. think so. This could work out. So, this will just be people that have HP. make this our just straight damage dealer pact. Three of our best damage dealers are all right here. Next is Danger Fang, which is our next be uh, good damage dealer because he has the one bow. The Bob, I think, is catching up, if not at the same pace at this point. The only thing different is the normal versus moon stance right there. Helps out a bit.
we want technically one other person that would be Vanguard and Zeno could theoretically fit the bill. Wait, what? Oh, that's female or neutral. That's right. Mage needs to be in the rear, right? Technically, yes, but in Dunham attack formation, the Vanguard is the one that gets the 70% boost in a DMP for magic attack. So because of that, technically the mage has to be mismatched. That's like the one downside right now. She's mismatched, but she has incredible fucking magic attack. And then showed right there. But if I go to, I think, change equipment, maybe? Yeah, like 551 from that. 1491 on this. Yeah, spells that furthermore don't mismatch. The only problem, and I do mean the only problem, will come in when it's that we don't need any of this, because this will make so they were more likely to be targeted. Give that all to the tank packs. If she's spamming fog. True. You have another Corsair? I don't remember. We have three, I think. We have Aegis. We have Zeno and... Wait. Am I missing one? Carly, that's right! There you are. About to say, yeah, I was forgetting one. Sorry. Put you right here because that's if they're over 80% HP, they just can get more damage. Or this for the first three turns, we do more damage. Both technically we want to be filled, but we have all these for the cats, or all these for that. A question, if I mix you in for one of these cats, does the cha uh, does the inheritance change? Not as much. What if I remove one of the cats? 48 and 50. All right, so return on investment is going down a bit on this, but it still works out. Still 50% HP, or 50%-ish HP in defense. What we want. That's fine. Now we just put it on the other ones that want the bonus too. So the Witch Course back can get attack plus 32% just by having the cat there. And this one as well, getting 24% with the cats there. Yep, the cats can now support other people. We have three of them. And with that, we're seeing a large amount of these ones just getting bonuses. Not only for the units that are in there themselves, look at that DMP up by 20%. But just others as well. Festival pack has has 25% speed and avoid increased as well. I don't remember if you have a lot of hit or not. 408. What is that in comparison to say Bob herself? 515. Not bad, Zeno. What about you? 367. If I remove Zeno from the pact, what does that do to you? 45, 50 still. Attack is 10%, 10, 7. Just the avoid goes up a little bit. What about here? Wait, that's right. Female or neutral is what's needed. So even then, this has its own little specification. I keep on forgetting that. Or rapid type. In that case. Technically, I want you to be targeted all the more than everything else, so sure. This might be it. I'm gonna save for the moment, then I'm gonna try something, alright? Narthex. We're gonna have no reinforcements. Like, at all. We are just unable to. 
We need to level up the pact a little bit in order for us to get any of that back. This foe right here. Stays the same mostly. I'll cut down all in my way. Test of damage, but also for you, Dunham. You have anything for a you have nothing to attack offensively with Dunham. Fuck! <laughs> we need to give you something, then just Nailed him. Here! Bullseye! Ha! Too slow! Yeah! Well, at the very least, there's one good thing about this in that. Ha! Torn off! The foes give a large amount of experience for double UV support. They give a lot of experience for Coven, so we're gonna get a bunch of uh, re uh, reinforcement points back. The obvious outcome. All of them leveled up two. 31 now. This now costs 18, 11, and 18. What you want to see? Now we could put this on you, on the one and only one. You have one empty slot, but I only have this one book, so I don't want to use it like just willy nilly, I guess. I don't know how else to say it. See if I can assemble one of my covens or one of my packs and then get the God damn you. Get out. Good. Yeah, I guess fine. I know I'm gonna see what else I can get from dissolving a pact. And maybe we could find one that works for. I forgot I had some of these equipments. Hold on. Could do some uh, silverfish. That is nowhere near as good as what I what I have right now. Rune mail is actually an all right piece of gear. The slow gothic edge. Mm. It'd be off to compare. Probably not. Probably not. Definitely not. Actually, maybe, but definitely. All right, this will give me a Dunham book, but it doesn't say of what. I wonder why that one's red. Why some, I wonder why some of these are red or, and the other ones are not. Stars. Oh, that's right. Means you can't inherit skills. Gotcha. Hmm. Did any have like some level that I or some ones that I would want? I don't remember. The black sheep one, for example, had 
Head Crush and Black Goat Strike and Black Mud. Technically... Let me check out the covenants real quick so I can get an idea for what those are. I forget some of these quite a bit. That was weak recon pack. What is this? Windblade damage slash. Strength agility. There's the one that requires on DMP. Black sheep pack, for example. And on strength and constitution. Strength constitution speed. Charge. Con and Dexterity. Trap Maker Pack, for example, is. Speed, 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 speed. I'm not going to decoy, of course. Index. Do any of these require deep uh, magic at all? Or will any of these scale off of magic? I'm looking at the bottom left and it says depends on agility and dex. Does one of them say DMP? Like maybe the disease pack, probably, right? Yep, this one says DMP. And it's for enemy all. It was gaseous mana. Strong AoE attack. And this one the duties back. I have a couple of those. It's a loot. Indeed we are, Dr. Y. We're in this for the loot. Hmm. I'm gonna, since we now know that we can get those, I'm gonna assume, I'm just gonna make this blanket assumption right now. I can get Lamp Fog 2, so Lamp Fog 1 is probably just fine to throw on someone. For example, this pact itself. I say before, so I want to say we're fine. Let's go to that same foe and see how much damage it deals. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. It's fine. It's fine. I don't want to kill you. Guess what? I'm going to now. I'll cut down all in my way. And Lamp Fog is 84. Actually. Fortify Coven. Fortify Coven. Lamp Fog. Even though we don't really need to, but... Did you get more units since last time? I did. I'll do my best. Resistance is futile. <laughs> Nowhere A natural near as conclusion. Much as I was thinking in terms of damage. I thought I, was, I was gonna do far more than that, but for blanket farming, that probably put hold like just some significance. Just small fries everywhere. 
And I'm gonna have you, both of you attack. And then you, Dunham. Everyone else defends. This formation You don't right? kill accidentally too fast. Die, pig! Yeah. Actually, wait, if the hammers go for us, they're just gonna kill it anyways. Resistance is futile! Be gone! Pathetic! Okay, Duh. again, it's only about 2,000 inch. It's... I guess maybe for farming, yeah. Exclusively, Victory. then. Victory! So that is probably more than what my both are the units in that coven will be able to do on their own. Aside for the mage herself, for some reason that mage can bonk harder than some of our other units just can with a straight up attack. She's like Jack from League. Let's go. Need to find a single target match, so yeah. And plus, it's also hurt a little bit just because. It's not a coven with more right mages. Here? Pulls up. Now, nailed him. Here I go. Take that. I no longer want chicken nuggets. Over. I would love some chicken right now, man. I my breakfast today was consistent entirely of four Oreos and a cup of water. Off. Vital hit. I guess I would want her to be in a coven with people that try more DMP to the entire thing. Cleaning's all done. Add it together. That went and well. Average, I think. I'm not sure why I'm actually not. No, I do. I do. I was about to say I don't know why I'm still just going here back and forth trying to fight this guy. Technically, it's fast levels for a coven. Battle start. That's what I'd call Bullseye. certain. Bullseye! Missed me. Bullseye. Everyone just Take attack. that! Meat Soldier Revenge? Meat Soldier does a bit too much, I think. Resonance cop! Ah, too slow! No chance! Well, this is just very quick. And I think Angelo had said at one point that... We did it! Bows count for like 18 times of a normal encounter. Yeah. So finding the uh, meat soldier would give us a um, uh, bows. Okay, 15 times experience. No one counters one. Yeah. So technically, any bow I think is the same. Reaper 75. <laughs> we are not fighting the Reaper, my good man. I don't think there's a benefit for killing a stronger foe, aside from just the raw experience you get. Let's go! I'll do my best. Die! Hit now! Bullseye! Together! Yeah! Take that! Now's my chip. I did it! Part of it is just that this foe right here, easy to get to, goes down fast, so the time is also less. Victory. Less time fighting enemies so you can, or less time in the turn trying to find other stuff, so everything can just get experience. Like, the middle coven just went up again. To which also to show the the amount of these things are reduced. This extra experience pack G, I think it originally costed like a 68 coven cost and now it's down to six at rank nine. Or is that rank 10? I didn't come to start actually. No, nine, I think. So it <coughs> very much, most packs are one or zero, yeah. So you definitely want to level up your covens at least a little bit. You'll get them just by normally fighting. There's no rush on it. But when you are at the point in the game where you can just sort of go to this foe Let and the battle punch begin. his teeth in, 
there's not much of a reason to not like hmm. take a couple of coven, yes, this does it. fight this one. And your coven will level up instantly, I think, like two times usually. Bring a dungeon run. For all I know, she might, Dr. Y. I have not played the game entirely, and I will not put it past. Though I would say there's a small chance of it not happening just because the Witch series, I don't think it's mentioned this guy up as like a ultimate world of any kind. It seems sort of self insulated in its own little way. Overlords, yes, but they didn't. Are you ready? Like, had like let's go or anyone. I think they are of mothers. I mean, you're not wrong, but form up at least as certainly from what I've seen, they have not dipped into the disguise. But I guess in its own little way as well, they've established these worlds can connect at least a little bit because we've had Metallia as a DLC character, maybe like. I don't know. Nachi Room uh, or any of the other ones can just show up as DLC Those if the game survive. is popular enough and they just want to put them in this guy. Gonna get the covens maybe one more. Jolie's a witch. I mean. Maybe they might connect together. I don't know. Are you ready? Let's it's go. It's to be seen and found out. To your position. Nailed him. Trash. You guys are in your tag. Yeah, I remember. Nice. Ah. Huh. Nice. Together. Yeah. Like, how did they say hi with comedic antics? Of course. Of course. That's the way it goes. That's the way how this guy rolled, and I love it. President's cup. Too slow. Here to help. Bullseye. Looks like that's done with. All right, there we go. Now they're rank five. With that, we will have like, what, 60 something reinforcements when we go into a dungeon. Maybe 59, 60, because we did break one wall. We've broken one wall. So that's like the one thing stopping us from getting full numbers. Gran Casa, for my family's honor. Yeah, with that 59. You're good that we just keep fighting that foe, but we're gonna have to do some fights anyway. That's mandatory to get through the next dungeon. So we could just travel with this and see how it turns out. Let me go ahead and save again. We're gonna solidify that lamp fog is now just on that coven and get back to the store progression. Over at Chancel. Alright. Why is there a square here that's just... Divine Lupine Shield. Wait. Hold on. Who uses the shield? Aegis uses one. Zeno uses one with hammer, though. And Carly uses one as well. What is that shield? Somehow less defense. But incredibly good crit resistance. Off the don't start. More like Darkest Dungeon, but yeah. While you're in this inky darkness... There's a sanity meter, and every step you take reduces it to the point that your party may start killing it, each other. We got one of the upgrades you can get in the witch petition, though, so that way it no longer decreases. It costs 400,000 mana. But I don't have to worry about it anymore. 
why does it show the danger level so high when there's no enemies around us? It's kind of the one all the way over there on the right. Okay, no, I think it's past. <gasps> what? Don't you fucking dare. It's down there, isn't it? I need to break a wall anyways. You missed a switch. Oh yeah, you don't say. But where would I? Oh no. Oh no, because looking at the map, I don't know where else I would have missed it. Which means it's one of the first switches I could have gotten, but just didn't. Because this is where you start. <laughs> A mud exit there. I have enough of these that I just don't care. But I'ma still be spiteful. Now go through the front door. We don't have to worry about that. Just break through that door or wall. <gasps> what? What? What am I missing? Calm down, come on. It's probably obvious that I'm looking stupid right now. It's probably awesome looking stupid right now. It's probably obvious I'm looking stupid right now. It's probably, I'm probably looking alarmingly stupid. It's fine, it's fine, it happens. It happens more than I want to admit, but it's... Wait, there's a wall here. There's something right on the other side of that, but <laughs> I can say it. Fuck. Just jump. That opens that door. Oh, fuck. I'm just n trying not to fight any enemies right now. There's an invisible wall. And now that opens. No, don't do that. It was up, so I think that does open that door.
got a package I never ordered. It's addressed to me, though. We fuck. What did I apparently get that I did not order that had my name on it? In the box that gives me another. Oh shit. Another box in it. It's a smaller. Oh. Oh. And uh oh my god. I want paper in this. But mm, that makes sense now. Some of you might know what it is just from the packaging. Just from what I'm ripping off right now, but uh oh god, what's ah! Okay, that's me being stupid, but all right, fine, that's good now. Oh, that makes a lot more sense now. Okay, I have a text message to send to someone. <laughs> someone bought me some shoes. Did you get a mastery model kit? No, if I got a mastery model kit, I'd be flipping out far more. I'd end the stream immediately, set up the webcam, and we'd be building it right now. Nah. I think one of my family members got me shoes. I think they actually watched my video, so thank you. I got them. Woo! I'll send a text to you right now, though, but... Uh, I... That was never informed. <laughs> that I would be getting anything like this. <laughs> family member did it. If it's not my mom, then I genuinely don't know who else not only knows where I live, but would even think to send me shoes. Like, I'm just assuming my mom did this out of nowhere, but uh, of course. <laughs> I hear a sound. I turn around, and I just look to see you be in the box that I just that just got delivered. Why do cats gravitate toward boxes? I don't know. And since you are frog in the box. <laughs> if I fits, I sits. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. All right. Was this the right one? There we go. We got it. I'm actually gonna put in a, a mud exit right here, just to be safe. And I technically do not know if it's gonna be a. Oh, it's not what I was thinking. I thought it was a gun. It was gonna be. Oh, go through every area to open a door. Also, you could come in here. No enemies, but... You just need to. That's... Oh, God. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Get her 
bug, let them pass by. I actually need to go through this. We're just gonna have more vision here. I don't see any enemies going through, so I'm assuming that I'm safe. Silver sp I'm getting a bunch of silver spoons every now and then. That was my last mud exit. One second. What is this, though? If it's not a forced thing, then it's... What are you trying to make me impulsively go to that's not here? Are these curious worth the trouble? My body refused to listen. Hey, we got one. Binard Seventh Royal Staff. I was wondering why they would just put a stairway right there, but the obvious exclamation mark for plot progression is just in the middle of the room. But unless you look to the side and you don't impulsively just go to it, the moment you see it right here. Huh. that level, I know. Without a 34th Curio, I think, let me check. Let's count, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34. 34 curios. All right. I kind of wish I'd save my mud exit for this, but I didn't know how deep I was going to have to go. So, all right. Let's just see what happens. We have 41 reinforcements to play with. You found a giant stone head, lying on its side. There's an overwhelmingly intimidating aura here. You sent the presence and hear an echoing voice. I see. So you're finally here. I've grown tired of waiting. Lucky to those at the space uh, mutation device. Grave robber of all the curios I've gathered. You. Thief lurking in Galeria's labyrinth. Space mutation device? What? You destroyed my labyrinth. Stole my curio. You think you own this place, do you? You'll compensate me for what you've done. I am the Marquise de Galeria. You will give me my curios and your soul. To me, right here. Just small fries everywhere. Alright, let's treat it like an actual fight then. I'm not gonna pump just yet. Let's see what kind of damage we deal on our own. 
including just basic attacking. What does it look like? A spectacle. Also, a different soundtrack, too. Nice. Now! Here's his effective. Huh? Huh. Here I go! Oh, huh. nice. Here's the effective. So are hammers. Huh. Alright, we're gonna have we're gonna have a time here. You're done. Yeah, the blue eye is twitching just ever so slightly. Here I come! Of course. I'm gonna stick to the given plan for the moment, but Equipment. Ah! that's just because Check. hammers and everything and stuff are very. Oh my yeah. god, we're doing Let's no go. stun damage now. Here I go. After you. Huh? Here I come. Huh? Three thousand from the lamp. Uh. That was close. Uh. Oh no! Uh. Oh no! All right, stuns could be worse. All right, now let's pump a little bit for our guy. Help, help, help. What? Oh, one coming because I don't want to burn through too much yet. Let's decrease your defense actually as well. Get to your stations. Bullseye. Jesus! A 46,000 a gore hit? What? Oh, I never repaired my gore. I never... Oh, God, wait. That, what did I remove from you? Back to the soil. You're weak. A defense? A garden? Garden watcher. We tore off an arm, I think, what it, uh, according to the symbol on the top right, on the top of the thing, where it says unknown HP. Like the top right one. So I'm assuming it's like the right arm. Or left arm, I don't know which way it's facing. But Garden's here. What? I can do haste one more time and like another pump. And that might be it. What arm? Read the head. I don't know. I'm figuring it out. A spectacle. Ah! Yeah. Ah! After you. Ah! Together. Ah! Keep it going. Oh wait, we used the defense ah! again, ah! like an idiot. You're weak. That was close. Yeah! What was that? Yeah, I accidentally used that again. No, Lamp Fog, why not? Oh, hit Garden as well. I don't know if we want to attack Garden or not. That's what I'd call certain <laughs> victory. Here. Together! Yeah. Ah. Ah. After you. <laughs> Got it. That was... Oh, guard's still in. That was close. There! Yet only the vanguard. Worth noting that, I guess. Right here? There! Here! Now's my. Yeah! Oh, we have to actually kill him, too. Here I come! All I did was fulfill my duty. 48,000. We could stockpile, but I don't think there's any more enemies after this, so. Hmm? Oh? Did my hit rate go up? Uh, of course I have experience. I'm leveled up! I'm struck. I'm struck. That's a. This it? Marquise Pact and the Marquise Meet A8. How would this be? What are you? Can I dare be overcome by magic? Very well. Let me ask you something instead. Why do you take the cure of the way? Is it money? Honor? Greed? Or are you simply following orders? I don't know what those intentions are. 
but I can see her behind your puppet soldier than marionette. A witch pulling pulls the strings. You may be collecting curios because she suddenly needs them now, but I won't allow it. Listen, I'll tell you the truth about this labyrinth. Surrender the curios and depart once you see. I am the Marquise de Galeria. I collect curios. I created and rule here. But I am also an eternal prisoner. Now that you know the full mundane truth of this place, do you still insist on taking them? Make a decision on your own, and I'll tell A strange light slashes through the Marquis de Galeria's stone head. What just happened? You! I... I see. You summon monsters into this labyrinth to wreak havoc. A transformed body. Secret witch magic. Yes, I see now. Well, that's it. However, I must tell you about one... That's why I disposed of my rotting flesh and had this body made for me. One that never rots. For all of eternity. So... The Marquise de Galeria tries to go on, but crumbles into a pile of dust without a sound. The Rookard bird watches the party with its with cold eye before flying off again in her unusual way. Probably best to head back to report all this to the witch. It's 7,000 mana. I don't care enough about 7,000 mana. Let's just bell out. This is the fruit of my labor. labor. Level up. My thighs get bigger. Let's save that we did that fight. And what what happens next in the story?